Hi everyone, I just came home from shopping at a local uh, health food store that I love to attend. It's called Simply for Life. There's many um, chains of them across the Maritimes and even a few in Western Canada. But what I like about Simply for Life is that I go there and I know I'm gonna buy quality food, quality ingredients. A lot of it's low carb, there's a lot of gluten-free options. So, and I always love those new things on the go. So what did I get today? Let me see. First one was this, it's called uh, Farm Girl. It's a nut-based cereal. It is from Ontario, I believe, and uh, looking forward to trying it. It's a low uh, carb option and uh, it's supposed to be very, very tasty. I got, because I like to have snacks, um, this is one of the snacks that I got. It's called Cauliflower Crisps. They look really yummy. They've got 11 grams of carbs just in the entire bag. So those should be good to try as well. I have, uh, beans are so good for us and you know, Beans that are salted have tons of flavor and they actually have a good source of protein. This little tiny bag has 18 grams of protein. This is a jalapeno popper. It's a bada bean. It's a vegan variety. Uh, it has um, 14 total grams of carbs, six grams of protein, um, and there's three servings. So this whole bag would be 18 grams. It'd be three servings um, from the, the meals. But you know, I love having these things like, you know, crisps, these like bada beam when I'm on the road, if I'm working late, then it gives me a great option for something to have instead of stopping for any kind of takeout food. Now these ones I've been wanting to try as well. They're a different type of keto cookie. So this one is actually called, uh, I guess sweet is the name. They're soft peanut butter cookies. Um, generally I like to get my sweet things from dark chocolate and I also do love ice cream in the summertime, but these ones should be fun to try and uh, they're sweetened with erythritol. I got a Eve's Chili Pepper Pumpkin Seed. So these are a cracker, they are gluten-free. So something that I wanna have at the house that I can dip, serve it with cheese, serve it with prosciutto, something like that. I got a Lily's Chocolate Bar. So Lily's Chocolate is sweetened with stevia. So um, it is a great way, it tastes really good and yummy. The bars actually aren't that bad, about six bucks a bar, but sometimes you want something a little bit sweeter than just the dark chocolate, because often I usually eat 90% um, dark chocolate. Now, I, my nieces and nephews uh, visit a lot as well, so I like to have a little something for them, and you know, Gatorade, G2, all of that stuff is just crazy. So generally I have sparkling water in my fridge, but I bought up these little packs of uh, True Lemonade so basically it's sweet with stevia. It does have a little bit of sugar, but one pack has three grams of carbs. When you compare that to a can of soda, 33 grams of carbs, or like Gatorade and those things, there's like 35 to 40 grams of sugar. So these are good little options just for me to have on hand. And then I've been looking for this for a while. It's Lakanto. So in Canada, it's really hard to get the Lakanto brand, um, but Simply for Life has this. So Lakanto is a great sweetener. It's made with monk fruit and erythritol. And the taste is supposed to be just equivalent to sugar. And again, it's a very, it's a low sugar option. Wonderful to use this as a diabetic, or you know, if you just wanna have things more healthy for your family, you can substitute this almost one-on-one -on -one, uh, for sweetener. So you need to try this one. And what else do I have in my other little bags? So this is kind of my snack bag. So I've got here, I've got sweet potato tortilla chips with sprouted grains, chia, and quinoa seeds. So looking forward to find, uh, having those. I do like tortilla chips. I usually eat old El Paso because they're just ground stone uh, corn tortillas, uh, but these are a nice one to try. And then I got some Quest potato chips. So now everybody needs a snack sometimes, you know, and one of my um, things that I really like, I do like Doritos. I like that saltiness, I love the taste of them. So I, I wanted to get Quest, I've been wanting to get these for a while. They're often hard to get in Canada, but Simply for Life has them on the shelf, which is wonderful. So these essentially can almost be a meal replacement. So in one bag of chips, you're looking at 20 grams of protein. So for a woman who needs about 60 grams a day, this could be a meal replacement. Now, I'm not saying to do that, but if you're working, if you're a shift worker, if you're on the road, if you're on the go, it might be easier to have a bag of something like this than not have access um, and choose an unhealthy alternative. So again, 20 grams of protein, three gram net carbs. That's pretty amazing. Now I must confess that I was hungry tonight on my way home from work because I worked late. So I picked up a bag of the sour cream and onion Quest chips. 
They're really good, okay? I love sour cream and onion. But one of the things, I did look at the menu, the meals a little bit closely. So this is a milk protein blend. So watch Quest Chips if you have any kind of dairy sensitivity. Um, and then it has a little bit of sunflower oil. It's got psyllium husk. And then it's got, you know, spices to make up the onion powder. But I was really happy because I didn't see any MSG listed here. Um, it does have a little bit of stevia used as a sweetener. But again, these were four grams of net carbs and 19 grams of protein. So this is my stash. So this is my uh, Simply for Life haul of food. Um, just wanted to share a few of these with you and hopefully you'll try out some of these varieties. Have a great day.